pretty busy recently with Helicopria. <laughs> <laughs> we went to New York. The Big Apple. It was a good trip. You know, it it, it got there. You know, it started off kind of rough. As many journeys begin, our journey begins at Boloco. You suck! Nelson, how are you? We're you all suck. sick and pissed you off. Suck. I'm yeah. sick. She's sick. I'm gonna you overdose suck. on coffee. Celine's mad. I'm mad. Drew's just normal. That's not fair. You're too tall. I'm too short to be in the frame. When Let's you guys leave. Stand behind We're me. leaving. We're leaving. I'm not so. Even though I have a brand spanking new gold backpack. This. That's why it's so heavy. Oh, you, you guys, this is a terrible intro. <laughs> We're going to New York. That's the moral of the story. We're recording an EP. It sucks to have a rock band on a bus. This burger sounds like this. Whose amp is in here? Why were we in New York? We've been writing a new EP, and so we were going to Rubber Track Studios to record it. In Brooklyn. But just drums and bass. The girls can't too. That me and Celine are coming to New York is we're, we're not coming for band related stuff and we're just mooching on this trip right now. We need to find Pikachu backpacks. If we don't find them, I'm never coming back. <laughs> Has our record gone gold yet? Prison. Chris Leon came along to uh, engineer and produce, and he did a great job. Speaking of Chris, he's from Germany, and I just received a message from Deutsche Post today. It's a speeding ticket. Look, it's got a picture of me. It's all in German, so I actually don't know what I'm supposed to do at all. But Chris did a great job back at the studio, too. It's not his fault I got the ticket. We don't get grilled cheese in South Africa. Why? Don't you have bread and cheese? There's a merry-go-round where you can sit on a big slow Lawrence <laughs> and try to grab the gold phone. <laughs> that is such a trippy ending. We're learning. Recently we went down to this radio station in downtown Boston called Unregular Radio. And that was awesome. We did Mad Libs on air, had a bunch of people call in. We even had one dude sing sort of Kiss from a Rose. Hey Drew! Shut up! <laughs> We're heading to Unregular Radio. We've been here a couple times. We're going to do an interview and premiere uh, the acoustic version of Scarecrow, a song of our upcoming EP. Here we go! <laughs> UnregularRadio.com Welcome, welcome, welcome to Citywide Blackout on RegularRadio.com. Your host for the best of Boston's local entertainment. I am your host, Max Bowen. My name is Drew. I play the bass. Bonjour, my name is JP. He plays drums. Celine, I play guitar. I'm Allison. Um, Alan! <laughs> I'm the vocalist. Alan! Alan. <laughs> Alan. They, I don't know what How happened. You guys, there's a YouTube video and they overdub the animals like doing things with the voice of just British people. There's this one little meerkat, he's just like screeching, but he's going, Alan! Basically they just decided I needed a nickname that wasn't gonna make me feel good about myself at all. <laughs> Wait, we actually have a caller right now. Hello, hello, you're live on the air. Hi, I'm calling for Helicopria. Eric! Yeah. Eric! <laughs> Eric! Is this Eric? Get out of here, here, Eric. We yeah. hate you. Eric. <laughs> You're so loud. Are you guys doing Mad Lib? We just need one part of speech from you, yeah, please. Yeah, yeah, and then we And it has to be as profane as possible. I don't really, I don't really care about parts of speeches. So I'm just going to give you a word. Oopie doopie. <laughs> uh, hi, this is Allison's sister. Oh, yeah! yeah! <laughs> I just called in to say that we are listening and... Uh-oh. Um, she says what? <laughs> she does disown you. Oh, can I take a second and just be like, Mom, I love you so much. <laughs> I am so sorry. Hello, Hello, caller. You're live on the air. Who that? Hi, it's Maddie and Steve. Maddie and Steve! <laughs> Adjective. Green. Who is this? Barack? Barack Obama? God? 
Barack Obama. <laughs> oh, it's <laughs> it is Barack. Hey. Oh my God, the president's calling in. Crap. I would like to recite the first stanza from Kiss from a Rose. Um, <laughs> and the word for the ad lib, I'd like to use this. I would like it to be used a name. in the most productively sexual manner. If I could just recite this, please. Please. Mm, all right. There used to be a grain tower alone on the sea. You became the eyes of me. Yeah. yeah, good job, Paul. Wow. You killed it. It's like if a thousand boulders fell out of the sky <laughs> onto one end of a seesaw. And you were a baby <laughs> on the other side of the seesaw, on a trampoline on the seesaw. And that happened. Drew, take it. Oh, no. And then you turned into an ant, which is even smaller than a baby. And all of the boulders turned into planets. And you flew into another solar system, and time and space were gone. And you heard this music. Name 45 minutes of helicopter set. Yeah. Also, we're playing some Justin Timberlake. <laughs> so what is left of me? What will become of me? Oh, how you've emptied me. What will become of me? What a stylish fool I've been to have let you budge right in. You may be your right doll, you was we were getting ready for our show for several weeks and we had set together and we were super excited. I got really really sick. Mono, which is also known as the kissing disease, kissed a girl and I liked it. That's Katy Perry. Katy Perry, Perry gave me mono. And the Monday before our gig, which was on Thursday, and uh, so we had to end up cancelling it. It was very very disappointing. It happens and we're gonna come at you with fire when we do play.